Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are fine and everything is okay. I realized this new to I realize I did this new tutorial. It's a very simple and I mostly use the uh, products that I purchased uh, last time that I was in Spain. They are for this Italian brand Kiko it, that is also available in Spain, UK, Portugal uh, and France if I'm not wrong. I will uh, leave, uh, I will leave Kiko website on the info box for all the products you will find it on my blog and uh, as a base as always i use this mineral foundation from neve cosmetics in light natural plus i used this time and uh, primer face primer this is from chorus and this is also a mineral one and it's very good uh, i mean I don't know the results because it's the first time that I used but it's paraben free, silicone free so I hope it will work well and I don't want to so spend uh, a lot of uh, minutes, I don't want to bother you so for any question please write me below thank you for if you want to subscribe I really appreciate and see you next time bye bye ciao ciao So let's get started. I already primed my lid with the Too Faced Shed Insurance. I put it on the lid and the lower lash line. And as a base, I will use this jumbo pencil on NYX in yogurt. All the product, as always, you will find it in my blog. I applied yogurt only on the lid and blend it with my finger. Now, using MAC 239 brush, I will use this color for Kiko, it's number 228, it's a top color. And I will apply on yogurt. Now with Zoeva pencil brush I will apply an aubergine color, this is also for Kiko, from Kiko 223 number. I will take it a little bit and tracing a B shape. It's not important if you are not precise on this passage because we will blend it only now with a blending brush let's blend it very very good this shape It's also blending, blending, adding. <laughs> now I will use an eyeshadow brush and Kiko Exotic Highlight in Peach. Sorry, there is the mirror effect is this cream highlighting highlighter that I will use down my brows in the inner part in the inner corner and also in the center 
or delete. Now, as eyeliner, I will use this uh, this Kiko Smoky Eye Pencil is number 03 and I will do a eyeliner I will put my eyeliner on the upper lash, lash line on the lower lash line in the waterline I will surround on my eye also in the inner part I will also join these parts and to finish I will use this last eyeshadow of Kiko is turquoise, green turquoise 212 and I will go on the lower lash line to emphasize, emphasize the effect As a mascara, I will use this Pupa Vamp Mascara and work it very good. This is a great mascara for curl curly effect and to give volume to your lashes To have a dull effect, I will apply also down. Also, this time I won't apply any concealer because I'm okay like this. Now I will contour in my face with Real Technique contouring brush and this. Kiko bronzer in 02 plush deep rose is a trio I will use the center part to contour my face Yes, it's not so red, but the camera gives this effect, I don't know why. Anyway, the most important thing is the final result is not comic. And now, as a blush ID, we will use this Kiko blush, it's 104. Is a this berry plum color? I will apply a small amount. And in the end, I will powder my face oh, with elf mineral booster 
There is powder anywhere, everywhere. Oh, accidents <laughs> occurs. And I will use a nude lipstick. This is lipstick. This is from Essence. It's number 05 Creamy Nude. It's one of my favorite new col nude color. And on it I will apply this Kiko 08 um, Instant Volume Lip Gloss. It's a nude lip gloss also. It's more brownish. And this is the final result. I check lips. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and see you soon. Bye bye. Ciao ciao.